I'm standing in front of the Trans-Alaska Pipeline, which is a very, very popular tourist attraction. About five miles out of town, very short drive. The pipeline is 800 miles long. It's underground, it's above ground. It goes all the way from Prudhoe Bay, all the way down and then over to Valdez. And the pipeline is raised above ground um, because of permafrost and also for animal crossings and migration trails. So these supports, there's actually 78,000 of these for the course of the pipeline. The reason that's there right here, this isn't actually bolted down to the, from the pipeline to this uh, unit, is for any sort of changes in the climate, any sort of earthquake, other natural instances where the pipeline would actually shift. It prevents it from having any damage sustained to it. The fins up there help regulate the temperature and if the fins weren't there, it would actually, the permafrost would melt, which is essentially ice under the ground. It really is a truly an engineering feat. It's absolutely amazing. So since it's just a short drive out of Fairbanks, the pipeline is a must-see for all Fairbanks visitors.